volunteers make up the heart and soul of the aptly named Heart, Love and Soul Dining Room and Food Pantry in the north end of Niagara Falls. But as much as they give and the 70 or so regular volunteers give thousands of hours yearly to supplement the work of the small paid staff, they get a lot in return. It's so well run, it's clean, the people are great, said Kathy Vontini of Youngstown, who has volunteered at the agency since 2003. I love the guests, the sisters do such a great job, and it's a fun place to give back to the community. The generosity of volunteers never, never ceases to amaze me and touch me, said Sister Beth Brosmer, the cheerful and unflappable woman from Sisters of Street. Francis of Penance and Christian Charity who has been executive director of the agency for the past eight years. Without her volunteers, she said frankly, I couldn't do squat. Over its 30 years, the agency, often referred to as Heart and Soul for short, has assisted thousands of people in a city racked by poverty. Today, the agency serves an average of 45 breakfasts and 155 lunches, on weekdays and on the last two weekends of each month, when monthly food money runs out. Some 700 people visit the food pantry monthly for groceries to feed their families, and about 60 children are enrolled in the summer enrichment programs. But there's more guests may visit the necessary shop to pick up such supplies as toilet paper, cleaning products, razors, and shampoo. A community care coordinator and caseworker provide referrals to service agencies and health care providers. Haircuts and Bible study are each offered one day a week. A Narcotics Anonymous group meets in the building, and once a month except in the dead of winter, the mobile food pantry of the Food Bank of West New York delivers a bounty of excess food. The staff is small Brosmer is assisted by just two other full-time workers, Assistant Director Pam Dixon and caseworker Liz Dixon. Pantry manager slash bookkeeper sister Mary Grace Polino is part-time, and other part-timers work as volunteer program coordinator, administrative assistant, in the kitchen, and as custodian. A part-time community care coordinator is provided by Mount Street. Mary's Hospital, with many guests getting their health care at Mount Street. Mary's Neighborhood Health Clinic less than a mile from Heart, Love and Souls Building at 939 Ontario Avenue, close to Main Street. We work very closely with Mount Street. Mary's, said Brosmer. A lot of our guests go there for their health care. If you want to serve their spiritual needs, you must first serve their physical needs, said the Reverend. Bill Allegretto, CM a campus minister and director of the Vincentian Scholars Program at Niagara University. Vincentian Scholars are placed at the agency for two years, one facet of the university's close relationship relationship with heart, love, and soul. The North End Agency, said Allegretto, has certain programs that help with the spiritual life of the people who gather there, and it could be with areas of community or kindness, or the celebration of Thanksgiving or special occasions. The importance of community was illustrated at a recent lunch when longtime guest Clara Pauka of Niagara Falls turned 94, and her family brought cake to the dining room so she could celebrate with everyone there.